What up, YouTubers? This is Mario305151. Today, I'm going to show you how to change the font on your iPhone, iPhone 3G, iPod Touch, first and second generation, running on 2.2.1. In order for this to work, your iPhone or iPod Touch has to be jailbroken. Okay? So, let's get started. I'm using my iPhone 3G. Before I show you the how to get the fonts I'm gonna show you how the fonts are right now you know stock or default as you can see there the YouTube service or Akai Berry Elite whatever okay what you're gonna wanna do you're gonna wanna go to Cydia Let that load up. Okay, what you're going to want to do, you want to go to search, click on the search bar, and write font swap, one word, font swap. So, here it goes, F-O-N-T-S-W-A-P. You want to click on search, and you want to scroll down until you see font swap. There you go, font swap. That's the one you're gonna want. Okay, since I already have it, my thing on the upper right hand corner says modify, but on your guys' iPhone or iPod Touch, you'll say install. So, what you're gonna wanna do, you wanna gonna click install, and then it's gonna take you to a page where you're gonna wanna click confirm on the upper right hand corner. Once you download it, click on the home button, and you search wherever, you know, the here it goes wherever the icon lands or the app and the icon is gonna be a capital A and a lowercase a you are gonna wanna click on that there you go and you have a selection from dialer fonts lock fonts note fonts and system fonts what you're gonna want is system fonts because that changes the whole system including mail safari um, let's see, text messages, anything that has to do with lettering on your iPhone or iPod Touch, it will change. So, you're going to want to click on System Fonts, and you have a, you don't have a real big selection, but, you know, it'll do. It's pretty, it's pretty cool. And you also have a default, just in case you want to go back and change it to your regular font settings. Um, we're going to go with this one. And you're going to want to click the first one, which is install and respring iPhone. Okay. Let's go back to mail and check it out. As you can see, it's very different from this, you know, the default settings. It's pretty cool. Everything from from text messages to the Safari. Um Anything you could possibly think of that has to do with the letters will change. As long, uh, uh, also with the numbers, so you go with that. And there you go. That's how you change your the font settings on your iPhone or iPod Touch. Hope you guys like the video. This is my second video. You know, I'm trying to get a little bit better at it. Um. 
please rate, comment, and subscribe. And, you know, I hope if there's any problems with your iPhone, just let me know. And I'll be more than happy to help you. This is Mario305151 signing out. Peace.